Okay, welcome to the Audulous Module Library tutorial. This is 2.1, Introduction to the VCO. As always, we'll read the patch and we'll talk about it afterwards. So, This is a VCO, a voltage-controlled oscillator. It generates sound. Turn this module up to hear the sound of the VCO tile. We'll do that in a second. Explore the controls of the module. They both change the shape of the wave in different ways. To change the pitch of the sound, attach this expression node to the octave input, so the O input right there. Okay, so we'll turn this up a little bit. I'm not gonna have this playing the whole time because it's just one constant tone and it'll get a little annoying, uh, but we'll hear what it sounds like, so. Okay, so this is the saw wave, triangle, and we can try, it. it's the overdrive in the triangle. Square and see this will this will trip up a lot of people I think because this pulse width goes from zero to one hundred percent so it might if the controls all the way down you won't hear anything you have to turn it up okay you, you'll remember this this pulse width control from the clock uh, tutorials earlier that that you can go from zero percent meaning it's never on to uh, oh, well, this, in this case, it's always on, it, to 100% uh, was always off, in this case, that, okay? So, sine wave, it's the pure sine, and we're folding the sine, which, if we zoom in here, you can see how it's kind of taking the peaks of those sine waves and pushing them around and folding them over and over and over again. And then the last one is noise, and this is just a filter control. There's no pitch to this one, it's just like that, okay. So, we'll go back here and we'll add this here. Oh, all of a sudden, you know, it's down in pitch, right? And it's not only down in pitch, if you notice, It's down three octaves from the uh, the center pitch, and that center pitch is A equals 440, and we'll talk about that in the, the coming tutorials. And so it really does kind of change the character of the sound. This is obviously a more bassy kind of sound. All right, so. The VCO. Why is it called a voltage control oscillator? There's, there's, there's no voltage inside of Audulous, but this is just an, a kind of naming convention. People know oscillators as VCOs. So it's it's from modular synthesis. If you've never encountered it in the wild before, that's really, you, you use uh, voltage to control the oscillator. It's saying the voltage is telling the oscillator what pitch to play. And in Audulous, this is sort of analogous, like this is the voltage. The voltage is like negative three, right, or whatever, negative three volts, however you want to call it. Um, there's no real unit here, it's just a number. Uh, and that is shifting the pitch down. The unlike oscillators in the wild, uh, which are with one volt per octave, uh, they are scaled so that they start from the lowest possible pitch that they can play, and then as you increase the voltage, it goes up in, for every volt, uh, it will go up one octave. This is centered at A equals 440, so that you go down or up uh, from that from that uh, uh, from that center, and you'll hear something. And and I and we we did this intentionally, so that uh, you can actually. Well, one of the advantages of it is that you can go down as far as you want. So you can take a VCO into like LFO range where where it's it's subsonic. You can't hear it anymore. Um, but also uh, so that if you don't have anything plugged into the VCO, you can immediately still hear it. You, you don't have to have a sequence or anything plugged in. You just pop the VCO in and you pop the output in and then you hear something. Uh, otherwise, it might be a little confusing uh, to people where you're like, okay, why can't I hear anything? You have to you know, plug in a pitch here. So it's just a convenient way uh, to, to uh, have the module make sound right from the get-go without needing to have a pitch uh, plugged in there. So uh, we'll learn more about the octave signal in the coming uh, tutorials. So just stick with us and I'll see you on the next one.